Hi everybody. Uh, camera's not looking clear. I feel like I've done this video a few times already, so I don't want to do it again. <sighs> Mercury's in retrograde, so we can expect some computer issues, and that's exactly what's been happening here. Um, <clears throat> anyway, I'll do this video again, because it seems like every time I do it, something's going on, or someone was calling, or, you know distraction. So when Mercury's in retrograde, there's just these little kind of annoyances or just going over things more than once or the computer has issues or whatever it is. It seems like, whew. Anyway, how are you guys today? Um, this video is going to be about polarities and balancing, merging, harmonizing polarities. I happen to have um, a lot of experiences with dealing with opposite polarities. This seems to be one of my big lessons in life. Um, I have mainly mutable, mutable planets in my chart, meaning I can go back or forth or see both sides of something. And so it's been my conscious effort in this life to harmonize the polarities. So light, dark, um, masculine, feminine, right, wrong. And oftentimes in my life I've had really strong views on either or, on one of these issues or another. And before I went through my spiritual awakening I thought I was always happy I didn't know there was anything wrong with me. Then when the spiritual energy hit, I'm like, boom, whoa, I didn't even realize I had tons of stuff and I had a dark side like everyone has. And um, I mean, I guess you could call it a dark side. It's actually just the side of you that is more, um, you would express more of these particular emotions. Um, in that other polarity. So you would feel more sadness, grief, um, solitude, um, just darkness in general, just going through yourself and maybe having even some issues with other, um, you know, emotions or feelings that aren't always on the positive. So um, for me, learning to harmonize that light side of myself with the dark side or even acknowledging that I had that other side was a big thing for me. But the great thing about really balancing and harmonizing and bringing these polarities together is that it adds such a depth to you. Um, I wouldn't have been able to help people like I do to really be the place where they can come out with all their deepest, darkest things and to stand in my strength because I've experienced these things as well and be able to hold the space for that deeper healing to occur. So, you know, this is a really interesting topic because when we see so many of the opposites all the time, we realize that neither is true. There is no right, there is no wrong, they just both are one, okay? So having a neutral view on both of those things, but really coming into awareness and coming to terms with the opposites in life is going to be helpful to you when you're dealing with these issues of ups and downs and all around and you're feeling high and low and all of these different emotions and feelings. So, um, you know, balancing and harmonizing polarities within yourself, um, the masculine and feminine qualities of your nature. So you may have been born into this physical body as a woman like myself or a man, but what does it really mean to integrate your masculine? Okay, masculine on a very high level, obviously. So when I think of masculine qualities that are on a high level, I think of protection, I think of leadership, I think of like standing in 
my full strength and my full power. Um, these are some of the qualities that I've wanted to integrate into my personality. These are my masculine traits that I would like to, you know, possess and to be able to utilize at any given time. So um, polarities are really all one and the same. So once you go back and forth enough, you end up in a space of allowing them all to be one thing, allowing them all to be. Nobody's right. Nobody's wrong. It all comes down to following your own heart on your own path, whatever that looks like for you. Um, so if you, um, if your heart is calling you in a certain direction, then you go that way because you want to listen to your inner guidance. And when you listen to that inner guidance, it's going to take you on the correct path, whatever that may be. And it's for a certain reason. Maybe there's somebody you need to meet. Maybe there's an experience that you need to integrate within yourself. So as you go through these polarity states and you come into a harmonization of sorts, you become all of those experiences in one beautiful whole. And it doesn't matter what you're doing right now. It doesn't matter what's happened in the past, good or bad. There is no good or bad. It's all just what it is. And through those experiences, you it has made you the beautiful person that you are today. It has made you the strong, you know, knowledgeable person that can go out and help others that may have gone through similar difficulties or even just shining that that light into the world will help you to um, you know do whatever it is that you want to do sorry I got a little sidetracked there um, again mercury is in retrograde and uh, my brain is definitely feeling it so polarity integration um, <clears throat> going on your path, your heart's calling. Me, personally, I am good at so many different things. And I, for a long time, thought, oh, I've got to do this one thing. I've got to focus here. I don't want to get all out there and all these different things because everyone tells you, do one thing. You are this one thing. But no, there's so many sides to my personality. I have so many traits, so many um, skills, so many abilities that I want to utilize every day, you know, if I can. <laughs> But I want to have access to all these things. That's what makes a person, you know, rich and full and abundant in their gifts and their skills and their abilities. So um, on top of that, I have many different roles. And you do too, I'm sure. Um, I'm a mother. Um, I'm a teacher. I'm a friend. I'm a daughter. I'm a sister. So in all these different roles, I don't have to you know, say, I'm this, I'm that, I'm that, I'm that. I am all of those things. I am everything and I'm nothing. Okay. So when we realize that the polarity consciousness on the planet is really creating um, a lot of disharmony in a sense, because people are, you know, whatever the wars are about, they're fighting over, they're fighting over, I don't even know what they're fighting over, um, but whatever it is, it's definitely a polarity. So they're right, you're wrong. Um, you know, nobody's really right or wrong. Everyone can have their own different opinions in the time and they're following their hearts and that's fine. Um, being an allowance of that and allowing that to just be is so beautiful and it feels so great, you know, when we don't have these judgments and we don't have these belief systems that are holding us back from really feeling into the whole, the whole of humanity. Um, anyway, uh, my brain's not working today, so I'm just going to let that be and allow that to be present. And hopefully you got something out of this video. And if you have any comments or questions or anything you'd like to add about polarities, I would really like to hear about them in the um, comments below. This was a request, so um, if there's probably so many things you could add to this. 
So thank you for watching. Um, if you would like to set up an appointment with me, if you want to go deeper into yourself or um, have any you know, really pressing issues or questions you'd like to ask me, you can go to my website, which is below the video, and um, you can find out um, how to contact me there. You can either contact me through my contact page or schedule a session with me. And I hope that I can be of service to you and help you. Also, if you have not yet signed up for Circle for Awakening, it's the new site um, where we're getting together. We're trying to get some projects started in there, um, some groups, so that we can start doing real work um, out there on the planet. It's definitely growing, and it's a work in progress. But if you'd like to be a part of that energy, if you'd like to join that, um, you can find that link below the video as well. So I hope you all are having a beautiful and magical day. I love all of you, and I will see you soon. Bye.